Okay, we're recording. Wait. Oh. This is just gonna be a makeup look, like, I mean, first video, right? So yeah, just to get ready with me, I guess. Um, I'll just do one of my like normal day-to-day -day sort of things just because like, like what else am I gonna do a challenge? Oh, no. I spent the whole day out, so my skin's disgusting, but so there's no point in using moisturizer, right? Like, yeah, no. Okay, so we're going straight in. Let's do brows. Of course, it's not here. Wait. Okay. So for, to do my brows, usually I'll go in with one of the Anastasia pomades. Can you see it? Yeah, these ones. So now I go in with Ash Brown, which still isn't the best match, but I'd rather look a bit natural. Oh yeah, if you can't tell, my brows are going through it right now. This one is, it dips. I mean, that's always been there, but I'm trying to fix it. I'm trying to have a brow revival. Oh yeah, today's my birthday. I'm filming my first video on my birthday because I figure if I don't make it this year, then it's time for suit. I can't live another year without like doing something, you know? Like if I don't make it this year, then ugh, I have to get like a normal, like whatever job. And then I have to pretend to be excited about life. Wait, why am I talking like this? Okay. Oh, this is this is stress. That's what that redness is. I only get it when I'm stressed. So, as you can tell, I'm not I'm not exactly relaxed in front of the camera. I've never done this before. <laughs> I've tried filming multiple times before, but every time it's just it's just awkward like and I want it to be like natural, you know? Like I just want reviving on camera. Why am I doing this? Money. I want money. You guys have to give me money. Like like comment down below if you would if you would give me money. And then give me money. No, but also I want to do this because I mean no shade, but like the makeup style right now online is so homogenized that like like everyone's doing the same thing. They're just like like full coverage and then face team the shit out of it anyways. And I'm not like, I'm not about that, you know what I mean? Like, I'm kind of, I'm one of those people who thinks he's better than everyone else. So I want to do my style and then pretend everyone else is doing, doing their style wrong. Like, I want to be... Can you hear that? There's a kid heaving. Do you think children should be allowed to live near adults? Comment down below if you hate kids. Subscribe if you hate kids. Okay, do my brows look even? Comment down below if my brows look even. No, no they don't. But, but that's chill because like, siblings, brows are siblings, they're not, they're not twins. Well, twins can be siblings. <sighs> Usually I won't really fill in my brows that much and I can't tell if I have because it's like nighttime now and I'm just going off of like, there's a ring light here. Usually I go in with this thing, this is my favorite thing right now. It's um, cover effects. They're like highlighters, but I put them under my foundation usually because I don't like a really intense highlight. I prefer it to be like, oh, he's not wearing highlight. And then I go boom. And it's like, oh, he is wearing highlight. It's like, like only when I turn my head, you know, this stuff is really pigmented. Like you only need, can you see? I can't tell. Like that much, like that's all you need. Also, it dries out, so like, make sure, make sure to seal it properly. If not, there's people here. I usually just go in on the high points of the face. That's what they're called, but my points of the face aren't all that high. Oh my God, is this even the right shade? It is. I have another shade and it's like more for melanin people, like Ariana Grande, you know, like deep skin. This one is better for the albinos. You see what I mean? Like, from when I turn, it's like, oh my god. Like, you, you can't see. And I turn back and it's like, oh, he's not wearing highlight. Yeah, that's what I like. Like, no shade to anyone who actually likes, like, a huge, like, glaring highlight, but it's just not my vibe, you know? Everyone's got different vibes. Okay, and then I go in on top of the lip just because, like, that's cute, you know? Like, it makes my lip, my upper lip look bigger because I have a huge bottom lip, but like no upper lip. Because I'm half white. 
This is the Chinese lip. This is the Caucasian lip. And then you can go in a little here if you need it. I don't, but I have leftover, so that's what I'm gonna do. Um, on the eyes, like just wherever you want a little bit of like sparkle, you know? Also, I have an oily skin type, so I wouldn't go anywhere near the, the, the nose or the T-zone. So like nothing here. Okay, well, I just put it here because I'm inconsistent. Yeah, see, that's, that's kind of nice, right? I like it. Yeah, that's chill. Okay, time for foundation. So recently I've been trying this thing, um, this thing. It's, it's whatever, like, it's pretty people makeup. Like if you have flawless skin, this is like nice, like just the even out skin tone. But if you have bad skin, get a foundation. This is nothing. This is like, it's a skin tint, if I'm honest. I'm kind of into the imperfect skin thing right now. Like I want to look like, slightly crackhead. Like, I don't want to look flawless. Like, I don't conceal my under eye anymore. So, you just take a few drops of this, like... And again, this is basically a BB cream. It's... It, like, helps even out skin, but it's second skin. So if you have first skin, the second skin isn't gonna look that great. So, I'd recommend this if you have, like, really nice skin. This is kind of my shade, but once again, like, it's such little coverage that you can get away with being too at most like maybe two shades too light or too dark because you just thin it out, like don't use a lot. How's the dog? Okay, so you see what I mean? Like, it sort of like evens out the texture, but if you have like blemishes, like it doesn't do anything for it. Like redness doesn't really cover. It's, it's like model makeup. I wouldn't recommend it. For concealer, I go in with um, Adri Wine by Maybelline. Um, this is shade Fair. I use Fair to highlight and light to conceal, yeah but I'm kind of out of the other shade right now, so I'm just gonna use this. They're kind of interchangeable if you're as pale as me. And I don't conceal under the eye just because I have really, I have creasy under eyes. So if I put too much product there, it just, it does not work. Like by the middle of the day, I've got the Grand Canyon under my eye. So I just like to conceal redness. So around uh, here, yeah. Okay, that's a bit much, but. Like that, that's that's as much as I'll go for day to day. Yeah, that's that's about all the skin I do. Usually I'll prep with like a moisturizer and stuff, but not today. Today I just thought, why not do a bit of a fun look? So I'm using the Huda, and I know Huda's not like good anymore, or we don't stand her or something like that. What'd she do? Was she... I don't keep up. But her products are good though. It's, well, I don't like her um, skin stuff because it's way too heavy and cakey. And I've heard that the baking technique that she does is just like not good for your skin. It dries it out. But her pigmentation is good and her, um, her shimmers are really good. So, there's that. Okay, so on this channel, this Chanel, I'm just gonna be posting makeup to start with. I just finished getting verified as a cosmetologist. I am actually licensed. I'm just waiting for my certificate as of now. By the next video, I should have it. And then you can't talk to me because I'm literally verified. Like, as a cosmetologist, I know more than you. Okay, not really. I'm still, I'm, I'm still learning. Like, um, a cosmetology course is a good um, starting point if you want to become an MUA, I, I feel. But you still need experience in the field. Like, I wouldn't say it's... I wouldn't say it's a complete education because you don't have as much hands-on as you should. At least in my opinion, like, what do I know? Eventually, I think I'd like to do um, tutorials or like reviews, or like how-tos, that'd be so fun. Cause I love telling people what to do. That's like one of my favorite things. So if I could have a whole channel where I make money telling people what to do, like, that's sort of my dream job. All right, I'm going in with like the, um, Wait, can you see me when I do this? Yeah, you can, right? Okay. 
I'm going in with this like minty shade, sort of pastel, but mint. So like mint. Yeah, I'm trying to keep it blended. Well, not blended, but just soft around the edges. And yeah, with eyeshadow, I tend to do more of a masculine shape usually. Um, sometimes I'll do more of a, a angled. I find that angled um, shadow where you go up towards the brow, that gives more of a feminine shape. Whereas I prefer uh, um, downwards or like at least outwards like faded. And I like a lot along the, the bottom lash line. I just feel like it suits my face better. Now I'm going in with like, I'm going in with this pink shade right here. It's kind of cute, it's whatever. So yeah, I've never actually properly edited a video, so this is gonna be fun to see if it turns out okay. If it doesn't, I'm gonna post it anyways, just because at this point in life, I'm 21 now. I just turned, today's my 21st birthday. So I'm out of dignity, like, at this point, if I don't make it on YouTube, I'm just gonna do, um, probably. The problem is, like, no one wants to see me do porn. Like, I've asked. People are like, no, keep your clothes on. So, I guess I'll just try YouTube out. I mean, it can't be that hard, right? I've seen some of the content. Find your niche, as they say. My niche is people who have nothing better to do. I don't know how to do um, makeup for camera. I, I'm pretty light-handed, so... This looks bad, I'll just filter the out of it. I mean, it's not what everyone does. That's kind of cute. That's kind of cute, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> if my friends don't watch this, I'm, I'm just gonna block them. Like, I can't stand negativity. You're supposed to like and subscribe. If I don't have like 2 million subscribers by the time this video goes up, negative, toxic friends. That's what that is. Like you're telling me you don't have the time to go and make three fake accounts and follow and like and subscribe. I'm trying to make a living here. I'm trying to be like, like I just want to take grabs. You know what I mean? Like my idea of wealthy is just being able to take a grab everywhere. I don't want to take public transport anymore. Especially with this virus going on. All right, in case you didn't know, I'm in Singapore. So we're going to die of Corona in like a month, maybe tops. So why am I doing this? I don't know. Like, we're all gonna die anyways. Okay, how does that look? Is that okay? I think it's okay, right? This is hypothetically, if I didn't sweat like crazy, this is probably what I'd wear out. But if I went out in the heat, this would melt off in like two minutes. I think I'm gonna go in with like shimmer, just, just because. Okay, I'm going in with this shade right here. Am I? I hope I'm recording right. Is that nice? I don't know, maybe. Yeah, mm, that's kind of cute. It's kind of cute, right? Like, oh, I have really hooded eyes. So whatever I do when I do my makeup, I just look like this and it's gone. Fun fact, one of the, my favorite features, just not being able to see my eyeshadow. Okay, so as I said, I don't conceal my under eyes just because I kind of like the tired look. Like, Also, I, I have a really hard time. I have to color correct and then I have to go in with a concealer. So I kind of gave up on that. If you have the strength to conceal dark circles, go you. But I don't. My original idea for my first video was to put up a green screen and have like Minecraft in the background because I'm a huge Minecraft. Oh, duh, like who isn't? But I figured I'd save that for like later on just because I don't want to alienate an audience, a potential audience in the first video. I'd rather like build up and then do stupid like that. Does that make sense? I think it does, right? Yeah, that's, that's cute, I think. I think it's cute. Yeah, it's kind of cute. I know this looks kind of stupid, but I mean, this is what I enjoy, so. Shout out to Joanna. You said you'd watch it like a hundred times. So like, I'm gonna count a hundred views and then I'll unblock you, but until then. Okay, I wanna blend a bit more of the purple.
say for the eyes and I think the brows. Like my brows just aren't great right now. Um, maintenance, no, um, what did they say? Construction in progress. So just ignore them. Maybe by the next video, this part will have grown back and I'll look sort of decent. Until then, just like focus on another feature that's that's not as terrible. I do contour. I like contour. But not the bronzy contour, like bronzing. I, I like a true contour where it's um a grayish shade. I feel like that's not as common as it used to be. Nowadays, people like using a bronzer as contour, but for me, because I'm pale, I do better with uh, an actual contour shade. Like, oh my god, I'm so sweaty. Like just like that, nothing crazy. I just like to define what's already there, sort of. Sometimes I'll contour my nose a little, but not every day. Just because it's hot here, things melt off. For contour, I go in with an eyeshadow, just because I'm pretty pale and everything else that I've seen on the market is a bit too warm for me. I use this Makeup Forever shadow, it's in shade um, M558. Yeah, it's like a taupe gray. It looks natural though. The cream version of this color would be Amber from Fenty Beauty. That one's okay. It's a bit... Mm, it's a bit muddy though, like you have to blend it out pretty well. So... Uh, what's next? Oh, sometimes I'll do lips. Not ever, not all the time. Um, this is this is brunch date by Sephora. It's like a, it's as neutral as I could find. I I don't like a hard lip, so I'll just go in like like that and. Yeah, that's that's the most I'll do for my lips. I'm just not. I'm not a lip person, at least when it comes to makeup. I'm kind of stressed, like I don't know how to video. So, not bad, right? Like, comment down below if I don't suck. Comment if I do suck though, I want to be cyberbullied so badly. If someone could just tell me that... that I'm bad, but like give no criticism whatsoever, just be like, you suck, that'd be great. So yeah, this is just a quick video, just to like try out being on camera. I don't like being on camera as it turns out, but I do like attention, so I'm gonna keep doing this probably. I'd say that I'm gonna upload once a week, but I also say that I'm gonna eat healthy and like work out, so like I'm a liar. So let's hope I film another one, like we'll see. All right. Oh yeah, my hair is going through something as well. I think my whole body is just going through something. My brows, my hair, my nose, my eyes. I think it's a midlife crisis. I don't know. Yeah, so that's it. Whatever, like, subscribe if you wanna. Like, I'm not gonna force anyone. Yeah. Oh, do you like my light? I just got that today. It's kind of cute. It's from Portal. I'm a Portal. Maybe I should do a Portal-inspired makeup look next time. I didn't even do blush. I'm too lazy to find my blush right now. Everything's kept. I try to keep tidy. Okay. Yeah, like, um, bye.